Hi friends! It's been a while since I filmed, so I don't know how to start. Anyways, uh, <laughs> not to ramble or anything, but I went to my favorite stationery shop, Lush Dive. I think I've talked about them a lot actually, but oh no, I went to their web shop, website, web store, because <laughs> I just like to browse and oh, sorry, and I ended up buying some stuff. Here's the funny thing, I, like when I was checking out, I was trying, I thought to myself, maybe they have some um, coupons, like you can write in and then you can get some <laughs> money off. So I randomly wrote student, because they do have student discount at the store, but I never tried it at on the online sh shop store, <laughs> but it worked, so <laughs> I saved some money. So I will show you what I got, and then I will do journaling. I will journal. It's been a while since I journaled on camera. I will show what I got. Ooh, these matches, but that was not intentional. Oh, let me get my journal. So I'm back in the passport. You're probably seeing that from uh, my stories that I bought the Traveler's Notebook Diary 2022 because I want a journal or I wanted a journal where I can write like the highlight of my day uh, that's why I bought the monthly and I want to do this because um, I watch Cozy Day Cozy Day's um, YouTube channel and they do that every month they just write like the highlight I think um, so I want to do that and I could have just bought the monthly calendar I didn't need to buy the actual diary version but this was not that more expensive than the regular monthly calendar and you get stickers it's also just a prettier color I feel like and I never got the diary inserts because they're really expensive but for some reason this wasn't that expensive expensive as I thought it would be so you know I just got it so I will of course keep this so I can journal it and then you get the guide which is just very nice and then the stickers so with the passport you get five stickers uh, versus the regular size where you just get two round stickers I'll be honest I do like the regular sticker a lot better like the design but um, you know I, I'm not gonna use that so I bought this uh -huh, you can see so the theme for uh, 2022 I think is um, movie soundtrack and then oh this looks nice so you already have the date written in if it was for me, I would have written it smaller because it's just very big, but I don't really write that big anyways. And I decided to go with the um, passport um, because, like I said, I'm using my passport more than I use my regular. And with my <laughs> regular size, I do have I have so many inserts in that. And I figured, I don't know, I just like the design of the passport better because I know in the regular on this side here. They have like the previous month, current month, and future month, and I thought that was just a little bit too messy. I don't know, but since I'm not using this as a calendar, um, I'm just using it as a memory keep, keep I guess. Um, I figured this was the best option for me. So I got that. I wanted these scissors for a long time. Did I need them? Not really, but... I got them anyways, they are tools to live by. I think this is my first tools to live by product. No, that's a lie. I do have some safety, no, some paper clips from them. <sighs> They're so cute though. <laughs> I've seen these in real life and I was like, oh, they are really cute. I do like them. But I have these, which I got from Tiger and they work nicely. I mean, 
they're like the ones you have to push down but i wanted a change so i got these and they're just small not sure how sharp they are but they're sharp enough i just gonna cut paper and i really like the design of them Just really nice i will see how they go in my pouch if it will take more space or less space we'll see and then the last three things kind of goes well together i don't know if you seen but if you follow me on my instagram if you follow me on instagram you know that a while back i did talk about wanting another kaveco fountain pen because i do have if i can find it I looked everywhere and it was right in front of me but I bought this a long time ago it is also a Kaweco um, Allsport I think they're called but the nib doesn't work like it, I can't write with it um, only like it was very scratchy and I bought it online from another stationery shop so like I didn't like I didn't have the opportunity to ask them what was wrong because it was a long time ago but this is the olive in fine nib so let me see if i can open this that is very pretty and then we have the nib which is in fine it is literally the same oh, same fountain pen but i can take this ring out and put it on here it does come with blue ink but i not gonna use that does it come with blue ink? He said it was gonna come with blue ink. Hmm. It didn't come with blue ink. Okay, never mind that. Um, but I bought one of these converters that I can put ink on. Um, never done it before, so I'll try and see how that works. But I'm excited. If not, then I do have some black cartridges. And that is everything for my haul. Um, yeah, I'm gonna clean and then I'm gonna test out the pen and then we're gonna journal. Okay. So I have this ink, it's Inferno Orange by uh, Diamine. Diamine. It's beautiful. I don't, you can't even see it on camera. It's beautiful. I won this a long time ago, I think two years ago, but I never used it because I didn't have a fountain pen. Uh, where I could take up ink so I'm gonna try it now I'm scared because I never done this before so let me just okay so I have the converter which said you're just gonna push the ink in and then you just whoop, and then ink is gonna come in okay I don't think I even opened this Put it in. Okay. There you go. So I didn't film this because it was very stressful, but yeah, I figured out how to do it. So I was stupid. I thought you had to fill this first and then uh, insert it into the pen or a fountain pen, but you have to put this in first and then you pull it up so this is what happened but <laughs> we're fine and um, I do hope it works now though hold on there was an ink in there <sighs> okay anyway so put this on twist it and then I just hope it works um gonna go wash my hand and then We'll see. I mean, so far it writes very nicely. Yeah, you can see that, but okay, here we go. Wow, that is very smooth. Could not be. Oh my god, okay. I am shocked because it actually writes and the ink is beautiful. God damn, okay. I am happy with that. This is actually pretty. I do love the color. So I'm gonna 
go wash my hands. Put this back on so <laughs> I don't spill it everywhere. <laughs>